How's it going guys? It's DJ here and this is my best class setup for the Weevil SMG. I know yesterday guys I said this was the worst SMG in Black Ops 3 and it still is the worst SMG in Black Ops 3. But I was lucky enough to go 36 and 6 in this gameplay on TDM. I got beaten there by the Weevil but I ended up killing them, wrecking the entire enemy team using this gun with this setup which is probably the only setup you can do well with with this shit gun. It's so bad. It's got like a 3 on the damage profile when the next lowest is a Razorback which has a 5 and everything else is above that in damage. This gun is just so weak. So bad. The fire rate, it says it's got high fire rate but it feels slower than Kuda. It feels slower than the um, the Razorback and I'm just like what the hell? How does this have a high uh, fire rate? It just feels so slow. It just does no damage and it's just one of the shittiest SMGs in I even think in COD history, it's probably one of the worst in COD history compared to all the other SMGs in this game. When you stack all the SMGs on top of each other, this is probably the worst in all together. But, anyways, for the attachments, I'm running three attachments once again on my setup. I think I've done that for every class setup so far, I've been running three attachments, and this one definitely needs it. I've got long barrel, fast mags, and uh, a grip attachment. I probably could do without a grip. It doesn't feel like it's that uh, inaccurate. But I'm just uh, going in here, trying to get as many kills as possible. And if you do end up going on those long range engagements, grip is seriously necessary. Uh, with any gun, obviously. But, yeah. Definitely long barrel. With its incredibly shit damage profile, you want to have whatever it's... Whatever good damage it has, you want to keep that damage out longer than any... Like, longer than... Um, Longer than uh, it used to be, so you need to have that de that like even that shit damage. You need to be putting putting that out more than you'd be putting out even worse damage, which is why I'm using this uh, long barrel attachment on this gun. Oh my god! I'm also running, obviously, fast mags because it has 50 bullets in its mag. I believe the gun actually reloads pretty slow, so. Fast mag is to keep it going. Like I said, in all my other SMG attachments, you're normally in like pistol. You're normally there in range of enemies, and you need to have the fast mag attachment to keep yourself going, and um, so you can reload quickly and keep the fight going. Like right here, I'm on a 15 gun streak. Didn't even notice. I'm on a ruthless gun streak. I'm like, holy crap, that's pretty beast. Um, and you should see how I end up dying. It's unbelievably stupid bullcrap, and I have no idea how I died, but it's hilarious. It wasn't hilarious for me, but it was hilarious. But, um, yes, this gun is absolute, absolutely shit, apart from this gameplay here. I think this is the only good gameplay I got with it. I'm like, holy crap. Every other one, it was just the worst gun in history. Buzz. There's a four man. Amazing. Beastage. This, this wraps right here actually blows me up. Watch this. It's like, YOLO, you're on a high streak. Boom. Out of nowhere, just blows me up. I'm like, are you kidding me? There's no one shot it. There was no enemies nearby. It just exploded. I'm like, that could have been a nuclear gameplay. Could have been a nuclear. But it has been destroyed. My nuclear gameplay, great. Um, yes, but my perks, guys. Like always, I run two perk ones. Six cents and either ghost or flat jacket. It depends on what's going on. If I'm playing TDM, I'll probably be running ghost more because people don't chuck his grenades as that much and you don't really. Grenades aren't that like necessary in TDM. Considering if you're playing like domination or like safeguard or something, I'd be running flat jacket because people chuck grenades left, right, and center and you're seriously going to need them. Uh, second perk, I had. I hadn't unlocked Scavenger as of this gameplay, and I'm just running the standard uh, default one, but at the moment I actually have Scavenger unlocked, and so I'm just running that at the moment, which is what I would be running on perk 2, because the rest of them aren't that great, unless you're like playing, I don't know, I haven't really used the tracker perk, but in my opinion, stick sense is good enough, and I have a good enough awareness, I know where enemies are running and where enemies are coming from, so I don't really need stick sense, base, uh, don't need tracker that much. And uh, perk 3, I'm running tactical masks just because stuns, even if people don't chuck them that much, you want to be aware, like, awareness isn't that necessary when you have 6 cents, because they both 
You can hear enemies in the same distance that Sixth Sense will show up on your screen, so it's not that necessary, basically. And that's why I run Tactical Master State. In case someone does chuck stuns, I'm here stopping them, ending their streak. Like, I'm not going to be stunned for 10 hours as I sit there and basically get, become a free kill. I'm going to shoot at the enemies and do something. Right there, like, the whole enemy team spawned on me. I'm like, oh, I'm dead. But, yes, the Weevil... I've... Okay, so this is the best... I've done the best class setups for every SMG except for the Razorback now. I do have that gun to max level as well. And, um... Over all the two uh, beta sessions I've played, I've gotten all the guns to max. All the SMGs. And all the best class setups are out. All of them basically have fast mags equipped. I th don't think I've got a single, um... Gameplay where fast mags was not equipped on my guns because it's just one of the best. Uh, quick reload is just so necessary when you're in like gunfights and um, you're f taking on two or three enemies and your gun runs out of ammo. Like right there, if I didn't have fast mags, he, he would have called me out on guard, but no, took him out and finished the game off 36 and 6. Such a beast TDM game. So fast, so beastly. Hope you guys did enjoy this. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later next time in another video.